The next technique we're going to look at is a mixed banjo roll. And what we're going to do with a mixed banjo roll is play thumb, middle, index. So it's similar to a backward roll, but we're starting our pattern with a thumb. Thumb, two, one, thumb, two, one, thumb, middle, index, thumb, middle, index, okay? And this is used widely, especially by players like Jerry Reed, Chet Atkins. And let me play you a few examples of what the mixed banjo roll sounds like. Okay, that's a little exercise that I will end up showing you, but that's a very common sound with the mixed banjo roll. Yet you can use it in some different ways as well. I like to use it when I'm kind of arpeggiating chords like this. something I use, for example, in the introduction of a tune. That's from a tune I wrote called Waking Up to Dreams. I'm using a mixed banjo roll pattern, and the mixed banjo rolls are often part of a, a larger pattern. Up next, I'll show you how to get into using the mixed banjo roll if you're new to this mixed banjo roll technique, where I'll show you some drills and exercises to really work out the picking hand. And if you're a little bit more familiar with how to use some of the mixed rolls, I'll teach you how to play those two examples that I just demonstrated.